I've already blasted the surface dirt off with the pressure washer and now we're ready to clean and decontaminate the wheels. I prefer to clean the wheels first before washing the car but it's up to you which way round you want to do it. When cleaning wheels make sure that the wheels and the brakes are cool as this will stop any cleaners drying too quickly. First I wet the wheel which allows the wheel cleaner to spread easier on the surface. The wheel cleaner I'm using is Chemical Guys Diablo diluted 1 to 6 which is a pH neutral acid free cleaner which is safe to use on all types of wheels. You always have to be careful that you use a suitable cleaner especially with polished or diamond cut wheels as acid based cleaners can prematurely corrode the wheel's surface. Spray the cleaner liberally over the wheel and let it sit for a few minutes. I like to keep my brushes in a bucket of normal wash soap with a grit guard at the bottom. If your cleaning expensive, delicate or new wheels, as an extra step you could employ the two bucket method for your wheel brushes in the same way that you would for the bodywork. I always spray the brush or cleaning tool with my chosen wheel cleaner, in this case I'm using a wheel woolly. Starting at the top I clean the back of the wheel first working my way down. Whilst cleaning the back I also clean in between the spokes as these are the dirtier areas of the wheel. The medium wheel woolly is ideal for cleaning wheels that are dirtier and that need a little more agitation, whereas the larger headed woolly I find is better if the wheels aren't so dirty. I tend to use them backwards and use the larger brush for the face of the wheels as it holds more soap and is softer. You can also use a comb brush like the Easy Detail brush for cleaning the back of the wheels and the spokes. Using a smaller wheel woolly or detail brush clean all of the areas of the wheel that the larger brush couldn't reach. This includes the back of the spokes and the lug nut holes. Then using a larger soft brush I clean the face of the wheel, the front of the spokes and around the rim. Rinse the dirty water off thoroughly, if your wheels are extremely dirty you may need to rinse a few times in between the steps above. The next step is to dry the wheel with an old drying towel. I dry the face of the wheel first and then the back of the wheel after. Next we're going to use a fallout remover to remove the bonded iron particles like brake dust that's etched into the wheel surface. In this case I'm using Troll's Breath from ProClean which is an amazingly effective fallout remover. Spray the fallout remover liberally over the wheel surface, let that sit for around 5 minutes to react with the iron particles. The iron particles that have bonded to the surface of the wheel will start to turn purple as they react and dissolve with the fallout remover, however do not allow fallout remover to dry. If you feel it needs more time either apply more or rinse and repeat. Once the reaction's finished, which is normally after around 5 to 10 minutes, rinse the wheel thoroughly to completely remove the fallout remover. As an extra step you can clay the surface of the wheel, however the above step should ensure that the wheel is as clean as possible and after claying you may need to polish the wheel's paint or coating to remove any marring left behind from the clay. Finally, we need to protect the wheel and make it easier to clean in the future. I dry the wheel thoroughly again. Then I spray the surface with CarPro Hydro 2, which is an extremely easy to use silica sealant. It's activated by spraying with a pressure washer or high pressure hose. You now need to dry the wheel for the last time and you're done. Your wheels will now look amazing and will be even easier to clean next time because of the sealant. You can also use a wax or paste type sealant, but I prefer the speed from Hydro 2. I find that paste type sealants are easiest to apply when the wheels are off the car. And that's how easy it is to deep clean your car's wheels. I hope you found this video useful, if you have please give it a thumbs up and click subscribe to be notified when I upload new videos in the future and if you've got any tips on how you clean your wheels please share them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Are you listening? Damn.
Yeah.